So, I, yeah, I went to Montessori school for three years. We played outside a lot. We went on hikes. Why did you go to Low Haywood? Well, Mom, you know, was working at the print shop, yeah. Bullshead. That was in Bullshead, right? Yeah. That was the part of town? Yeah. Um, and she had started just sort of helping carry it because that was her best friend. Yeah. And then when I started going to school, she stuck around longer and ended up working there forever. Yeah. And so one of the clients was, I think, the principal. I don't remember her name. Our assistant principal of the school. And she would come in for, like, stationery, you know, because they would make it with yeah. Lil Haywood on it. It wasn't like these days yeah. where you just make it yourself. Yeah. Um, and business cards. And so my mom said to her one day, oh, I wish I could send my daughter to a school like that. And so she encouraged her to apply for financial aid. And she did? Yeah. And they took you? Yeah. Did you like, you didn't like it that much then? No. But mom liked the idea of you going there. It was a good school. It really was a good school. Yeah, it was a good school. But, um, I mean, it, was, it had small classes. It had good teachers. I learned a lot. I mean, I think I was a good, a smart kid anyway. Yeah. But I didn't like um, the kids. They came from a very different demographic than I did. Upper class, so upper class. Uh, yeah, to say the least. They had boats and airplanes and Mercedes, and they got their own cars, like you know, nice cars. Um, they lived in huge houses in Stamford, and uh, they were very spoiled. People think because I'm an only child, I was spoiled. You weren't spoiled. No, I was. Maybe I was spoiled with love, but not things. No one. Uh, I, I was sort of not on my own. <laughs> so dramatic, but I had to be resilient. You know, my mom was scared of the. Uh, parents at La Haywood. Why? Because they were like rich and bougie and she was just like this ordinary very middle class yeah. girl. You know, like she didn't feel like an adult. Yeah. And they um, intimidated her without doing anything intimidating. Um, and I don't think I was... So she stood down? Sort of? Yeah, yeah. She was not involved in my schooling at all. Um, and I... I I started getting in trouble probably in like sixth grade. What did you do? 